Hi guys, Max here from ShopSolarKits.com. Today's video, we're going to go over how to connect solar panels in series and then how to connect solar panels in parallel. We're going to go over what you need to do that and what happens when you connect in series versus parallel. So we're using four 100 watt, 12 volt monocrystalline solar panels. You can see one, two, three, four. These are your standard MC4 solar panels. They all have two MC4 leads coming off the back, a male and a female, a positive and a negative. And this is what we're gonna to use to demonstrate how we connect in series versus parallel. When you connect solar panels in series, what you're doing is raising the voltage of the overall solar array. When you connect solar panels in parallel, you're raising the amperage of the overall solar array. So depending on like your charge controller or your application, you might want to connect your panels in series, you might want to connect your panels in parallel, or you might want to do a mix of both. So I'm going to show you how to do both of those actually in this video. Um, so let's get to that now. Connecting solar panels in series is pretty much the easiest way to connect solar panels. You don't need any extra parts or pieces to do it. Um, I'm going to be referring to the leads coming off the back as male and female. You can refer to them as positive and negative, but people get really held up and confused about positive and negative. There's really one male, one female, and they're gonna to snap together or they're not gonna to snap together. And that's all you need to think about when uh, the leads come off the back of the panel. So if I'm gonna connect these four panels in series, what I'll do is I will take the first like female lead that comes off this one and plug that into the male lead that comes off panel number two. These two panels are now connected in series. Now, so this second panel here, it has one lead that's connected. The other lead, I'm going to connect into the third panel. So now we've got three panels connected in series. So this middle panel has both of its leads being used by the two panels beside it. One, two, three, this third panel, its second lead that's still left off, I'm going to connect, the, it has leftover female into the male part of the fourth panel. All four of these panels are now connected in series. Simple, super, super simple. You haven't needed to do anything else. Furthermore, what you can do if you wanted to get four panels like this connected in series and bring that into a generator is you can use MC4 extension cable here. And so I can snap this in like this and I can snap MC4 cable like this. And now I basically have four panels that are connected in series, run into two MC4 extension cable, and I can run this you know, into my solar generator or into my solar application. And so this is very simply how you connect solar panels in series. We're now gonna go over how to connect solar panels in parallel. Again, very straightforward, very simple, but you will require branch connectors in order to connect solar panels in parallel. So I'm gonna demonstrate here because I've only got branch connectors. As you can see here, they've got two, male, male, female, female, that leads into one, okay? So this is how you're gonna connect uh, two panels in parallel is with branch connectors like this. So these branch connectors are for two panels. You can get this, I'll link to some photos right now, but you can br get uh, branch connectors for like three or four panels. Um, but yeah, these are two. So this is all you're gonna wanna do. Again, you can't screw it up. Um, there's two male and two female, and you just make sure you plug those in from the other panels. So from, let's call this panel one and this panel two. So off of panel two, I'll take a male and plug it in, and off of panel one, I'll take a male and plug it in. And then off of panel two here, I'll take a female and plug it in, and I'll take a female and plug it in. Now you have both of these panels connected in parallel, which run into your branch connectors, and then from there, you can connect, you know, your MC4 extension cable in, plug it in, and run that into a solar generator or into whatever application you're looking for. But these two panels are now connected in parallel. All right, so let's connect our solar panels in series and in parallel. So let's call this panel one, panel two, panel three, panel four. What we'll do here is we'll connect panel three and panel four together in series. This is now acting as one big panel, number three and number four. Let's do the same thing over here with panel one and number two, panel one and two. We'll connect it together in series. So now this is acting as one big panel. So what essentially we have now 
is two solar panels, but it's two solar, it's one and one panel connected in series, one and one panel connected in series. Now this looks like two big solar panels. The next steps are you basically just take um, a parallel connection exactly like we've already done, but with the slightly kind of bigger panels here. So you can't really screw this up anymore. So let's say we'll start with the female uh, branch connector here from our panel one. We'll take the male lead and we'll connect that in. And then from panel two, we'll take the male lead and leave that in. Now what we've got from our panels three and four here is the female. So that will go into the branch connector. We'll do the same thing over here. Boom, and we're really done. So now we have two sets of series, two sets of series connected in parallel. That all leads down to the branch connectors here. And from here, you know, we can plug our MC4 extension cabling in. And you know, and then at this point, and then at this point, all you have to do is really run this. So we've connected four panels together in series and in parallel, and it runs down into some MC4 extension cabling. Here, you know, you can run this into, you know, your solar generator, uh, you can run it into your RV, uh, into your shed, whatever solar setup you have, um, they run down into these extension cables and you're done. So this is how you can connect multiple panels in series and in parallel um, and run it into some MC4 extension cabling.